So this little motor has just completely smashed all my previous records for running on low voltage. Uh, I've got this in a configuration right now where it's running on 20 to 30 millivolts. And uh, you can see it's just spinning right along there. So I am really, really happy with that. Um, I've got, yeah, like I said, 20 to 30 millivolts across the capacitor here. And it's running in the microamp range on extremely low voltage. So. But what's really amazing to me is the voltage that this is running on. So right now this is running on 8 millivolts. Let me get the uh, camera up here. 8.4 millivolts. And uh, this thing is just running along. It'd probably run down even on, you know, a few millivolts less than that. But that is the lowest voltage uh, motor I've ever created. And you know, it's drawing in the microamps in addition to that. So this opens up a lot of possibilities for some ultra long running uh, experiments. And uh, stay tuned for that. I will get into that uh, in an upcoming video. Okay, so to wrap up this video, I just wanna do a quick test. I'm beginning to hook up the generator coils. Right now I have three uh, rectifiers, all connected to a common point to do some uh, measurement readings. And you can see right now I'm driving at one volt. Uh, the milliamp draws less than this power supply picks up. Now I've got it tuned to a sweet spot. If I move this, you can see now it's pulling 20, 30 milliamps. But there's a sweet spot here where it drops off to zero. Now it's not really zero. It's just less than this uh, meter can read. And at that point, it's generating about, well, let me get back to the sweet spot. There's one spot where it generates about 10 volts. Yeah, it might be right in there. Anyway, close enough. 9.6 volts and climbing. And uh, let's check the uh, milliamp. You can see it's generating almost a milliamp. 0 0.8, 0 0.7 milliamps at 9 to 10 volts. So, let me go ahead and connect this up to an LED. Okay, so here's the first test on this Easy Spin flat motor. And on this test, I'm driving it kind of like a jewel thief. I'm driving at one volt. Uh, you can see one volt there in the power supply. And then that's stepping up the voltage uh, to power this LED here. So I have some uh, rectifiers here. And uh, two of the coils are drive coils. So these two coils are driving and the rest are acting as generators right now. And uh, steps the voltage up and gives you a jewel thief uh, functionality. Uh, and in a motor.